Yeah. Well, compared to when we bought the house, it was just a little wee crack. It's a visual cue Bert Izzard couldn't ignore. The homeowner has a lot to lose to water damage in his basement. There's this $4,500 worth of hardwood flooring down there. And if it got water in, that flooring has to be all tore up. And there's the major damage of cost of having it tore up, plus replacing it. So you're looking at about $10,000. Moisture stains on the floor and cracks in the wall. Signs H2O has already done damage. Uh -oh. Bert called in the pros, armed to fix up a potentially leaky mess. Even if a crack isn't leaking, it's important to have it repaired because it will leak eventually. So the first here, test is to follow your nose. Crack. If your basement uh, smells musty, that means that you have mold or mildew. Before the problems start, the best way to deal with rain damage is to prevent it. Chris Lemire has noticed a lot of customer complaints about the recent rain. His best solution to avoid water damage is to make sure your eaves trough is clear of debris. So you're saving yourself in the long run, absolutely, because you're moving the moisture and water away from your house. Grates and downspouts are some affordable add-ons outside. But when dampness seeps inside the basement, humidity can be an issue. The simplest way is to put a dehumidifier in the room, uh, let it run for a little while, and extract the water from the air. Generally priced between $150 to $300, the machines can prevent mold from growing. They're do-it-yourself ideas if you don't have to call in the experts. No, it's not good, so you try and prevent it before it happens. Now this homeowner can relax, even if Mother Nature delivers more wet weather. And another tip is to make sure that your windows are well sealed to prevent mold from growing. And dehumidifiers are also a good idea, not only when it's raining, but also in the warmer months, if they ever get here. Bruce? <laughs> they will eventually. We I'm will. hoping. <laughs> Thanks, Felicia. You're welcome. CGV's Felicia Yap reporting live tonight. Here's Star.